great shoes out there and i think in general nike acg right is probably one of the most underrated um divisions of nike i think it's thoroughly 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 um uh, underexposed underexploited underused people don't pay too much attention and i guess like all nike archive pieces especially stuff that people are not aware of it's just going to take one cool person i don't know someone that everyone likes on social media a luca an asap rocky an asap nast a neon connor a, a, a young lord whatever it may be right one of those people are going to have to come out and wear some hg pieces to, to kind of get it sky high i know they tried to get the acronym dude to kind of do some stuff that didn't really work out now they, they they're kind of doing it in-house but ACG hasn't really taken up, and I'm not sure why. But it's honestly one of my favorite, favorite divisions of Nike. And one of my favorite pieces from there is the mock, right? The Nike mock. It's a weird shoe. I think it was inspired by a potato or some shit. I remember the designer saying something about it's inspired by the potato. And I'm a big fan of it. I wore it for many years when I was um, very much interested in sneaker culture. I had this brown pair here that I've got here on screen. I'm going to upload it for you here. That's all the OG way colorways. You've got this sort of like stony colorway. You've got this nice mud color and a black colorway. I had a black and this sort of stony colorway that I had for a while that I used to wear all the time. So much so that I'm going to show you a fit of me actually wearing them if I can find them on my Flickr account. Do you remember Flickr? Yep, still got mine. Um, see if I can find them here. I've got saved them my albums of all my outfits from back in the day, which is quite cringe, but you know, it is the way that it is. Where can I find my what did I wear today post? Where is it? I've got a whole album. Yeah, I've got 250, 59 posts photos of me wearing outfits near 260 pictures of me wearing clothes right and some of them are going to contain an air mock i'm pretty sure let me see if i can find some of the swaggy outfits i wore back in the day oh, i've got an acg here actually that i'm going to show you that's you that, that you should that you might like where is it mm -mm. this is an acg too uh what was that it's a, that's that's the arriva isn't it right so i've got an arriva shoe here that obviously i'm showing you from there from 2008 uploaded on Flickr amazing epic content over there and then let me see if i can find the mock there's an image of me wearing a nike mock i think with like a um a hiroshi fujiwara nike sportswear jacket thingy that i had i'm pretty sure let's see if i can find it do, 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 do. let's go back to the album and scroll down see if i can find that picture of me wearing the mocks I think it's one of my honestly one of my favorite shoes and a shoe that I wish I could kind of get back into now but I don't really wear that sort of style anymore so it's hard to do it again but let me see if I can find it here I had absolute swag back then and I was always flossing me so here here's the image of me wearing the shoe woohoo so this is the me wearing the air mock i've got um what's the hoodie again that's from uh that's one of the old Hiroshi Fujiwari brands but a very Japanese inspired outfit as you can see here from the picture I've got a nice sportswear raincoat on and a nice t-shirt underneath some jeans rolled up in the air mocks with my socks showing got a good enough t-shirt good enough fleece every dirty showing there yep i was all about that life obviously nike air stabs there and some other stuff i was wearing but yeah i'm a big fan of nike air mock but they're gonna bring it back right they're bringing back the nike air mock and they're bringing it back in a different sort of style something that we haven't seen previously it's sort of like a weird north face sock thing the shoe that north face did um it's here on heights and Abiety. i'm pretty gonna show you on the screen so this is the Nike ACG new Mock 3.0 is for the campsite recovery and casual days in the city. And I'll wear, I prefer to wear stuff like this than sandals. The sandal thing is I'm not really a big fan of. So it looks a little bit like the North Face thing that you might have seen this, the kind of shoe that they have. Um, let me see for local image down below. The key features the Nike ACG Mock 3.0 features an asymmetrical upper for easy and on and off, as well as a footscape inspired chassis with a Nike Solar Soft a cushioning. Okay, so it's got a Nike. Okay, so it's different from the Mock. It's got a footscape sole, essentially without the laces. It's not really a mock, is it, really? Does, do they call it a mock 3.0? Okay, it's a bit of a hybrid, isn't it? I'm not really a fan of hybrids. Anyway, so, so you, let's go again. Editor's note says the following. The Nike SCG will soon be releasing the latest iteration of the mock, which originally released in 1994 for campsite rest and relaxation. Similar to original mock, the 3.0 is outfitted with a simple upper and soft sole and sneaker incomprising incorporates the new footscape inspired sashi with nike so soft cushioning but i still like the og man i think the og is better in it that's so nice right that compared to whatever the 3.0 looks like they should just update they should have just updated that upper with the footscape sole i would have quite liked that as and then maybe with the same sort of tread at the bottom instead of having that weird sort of like let me go back to where is it uh over here right let me move this over there yeah yeah, yeah. where is it is it? instead of having this weird sort of like 
overlapping flat thing, right? I'm not really a fan of that. I think they should have just done that upper with that sole. Would it probably work better? And the similar tread, and again, with the swoosh in the front, just looks a bit weird. Um, releases in cheetah print colorway, exclusive at Union LA in Japan. Nice tie in there in terms of the. I like the fact that they're releasing shoes at specific stores that would probably be more receptive to actually buying a shoe that makes more sense as opposed to like flooding these all over size and offspring and stuff you know cus general customers aren't probably going to wear these unless they're on sale but again i prefer the ogs i think the og looks a lot more better i would probably soul swap if somebody could soul swap those with an, a footscape so i'd be super down for it um but yeah that's a new version of the mock 3.0 it looks probably better from the side in it so imagine that on the side so this one, like this image there on the side with that sole, that looks super cool in it, I reckon. But yeah, um, again, I'm not really a fan of hybrids and I don't like the fact that they kind of essentially took everything away from the mock that makes it special and just turned it into like a, a tent on your shoe. But again, you know, I'm, I'm glad they're at least going back into the ACG archives and trying to bring back some of these iconic shoes that I think have been undervalued in the sneak industry at the moment. I quite like the other color actually, that's quite nice. And the old black one's really cool. I think so. This one there, that looks pretty nice. But yeah, check it out. It's going to be out when? A little bit. December 9th at Union LA and Union Japan. So check it out if you're near those places and like the shoe, of course. Um, 